Hi guys. Hope you are all doing fine. Okay, this is what we will be designing tonight. This card, this card, this complimentary card you are seeing. Okay, that's what we'll be designing. So I want you to watch the video to the end as you don't want to miss out in this experience. Okay, to design this kind of professional card and make your money online as a freelancer. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, you can also send it to your friends. Okay, in case you don't know me, my name is Res Kilowans, I'm a graphic designer and I bring you updates. I bring you information on how to design with your smartphone and bring tricks. You can as well join our academy to gain more knowledge and info about how to start to become a graphic designer with your smartphone professionally. Just click on the link in the description box below to bring you to our to our bio so that we can communicate. Don't forget that a skill was So guys, you are welcome to this video tutorial. Okay, to my students, a skill was graphics. Like I told you, I was going to add another video. So this is a professional business card that you can do as a freelancer and make a ten dollar online. So it's no play. So I want us to watch the video tutorial as my voice is going to be in the background to the end of the video. So now I want to pick a default page. Okay, this is the ultra pixel lab. Now change the background to white. So that will see what we are doing. Now the set the paper size. Okay, to one five four five by one thousand. You see, this is the size of this 1545 by 1000. So you go to color. I'm already, I'm going to set the color now. Look at the color I'm going to use. It's dark green. This is it. Dark green. I'm going to set it again so that you see. When you see dark green, then you click on this plus icon. Then you drag this one, this center one to the left. Okay. And you see. Now in that dark green, so you okay it. So that's all we use it for our background. Now, I want you to follow the video carefully. Okay. You okay, it. You want to get half. You see, it's your grid line to you get your DC. Then you lock it. Now we we'll change the background color so that we we'll see what we are we'll see what we are doing very well. So, okay. Just put the background on that dark green. Put it on that dark green. Okay. So let's change the color of this shape, this white shape. So that we see what we are doing very well. And you see now, we will later change it to white. So now, I want to go to my gallery. I want to bring in a logo, business logo. on png so you just place it there you can use png image any anywhere for anything okay are we following guys Go to font, okay. Pick a font, okay. Pick a nice font. This is the font to be using. A brilliant face, okay. You add padding, make the padding 3 3 left and right, okay. You okay it, you place it there. Make the sign start first. You can increase it later. Use your position key to 
place it in the center. Make sure it's in the center of the shape. I want to bring in another text again. Graphics design agency. This is my own brand card, okay? I'm just using it as sample. And do your own too. So be using this one, this one. I'm a town uh, both. Add padding. Three three. And you reduce the size. Twenty four. Place it there, you can edit it later. I'm following now. You can lock those ones. I want to bring in a shape now. I will give this the color of this shape. Look at the color I'm going to pick. Yes, that one. Easy. Okay, play with the shape, play with the shape, it's easy. You copy it. Use your position key to bring it to the center. Okay, then you move it with this relative position key. Come here and turn it. You can turn it this way. Make sure it's straight. If your hand is shaking, use this rotation key, this one. To rotate. Okay, make sure it's on uh, I think 45 or 90. So rotate, use the rotate, it's on 90 straight. So now use your position key to move it up, and you see it's easy. So if you see it's okay, don't make it too big. It's okay like this. Copy it. Then use the position key to bring it down there. Are we following? On your grid line, check your work. Okay, it's like magic. It's your smartphone that we are using to design like this. Okay, you can align it from one side. Okay, once it's straight on one side, it will definitely be straight on the other side. So now, I want to lock. Are we following, guys? I want to write. It's easy, okay? You should follow the step. This video, we definitely we do more than this, okay? Mm -hmm. Sorry about that, please. You keep keep part error. So we'll be using this blogger sound. Okay? Change the color to black. Don't forget that shape that is on red. We'll see change it to that is not the normal color. Okay? I wanted to, because of this shape. And the background that is white, that's why I use this uh, red color. I'll soon change the background before we finish. So now I want to bring in another text again. Can you see? Don't use more than three fonts in your design, okay? Be smart. 
to play. And our colors too, we we'll use more than three. So this text now, we won't be using any font, we we'll just place it there. Look at what I'll do now. I'm just going to make it not look as if he's struggling for attention. So now, I'm going to give it the same color. And I'm, I'm going to bold text to bold it. You understand? So you place it there. So now, this shape, I want to remove it down a bit. You take your time, watch the video to the end, okay? And you understand what I've been talking about. How powerful your smartphone is. You can use your smartphone to make money online. So make sure to always centralize your work. Place your work in the center. And use your grid line. So it's in the center now. What we are going to do now? We are moving. We are moving. So this is what is straight. I want to bring the. In. The icons you can go to google google.com okay get icons um call move phone call icon png a uh, messaging icon png um web icon png you can also get the location icon too so i'm going to bring in all this icon let's see if i can erase the color here let's see Okay, okay, we'll use this one. We'll place it here. Then we'll go back to our gallery. Bring another one. Okay, make your work faster. Um, let's use this one. Let's see if we can erase this color too. All these ones are on JPEG, so so there's way you can erase white background on Pixel Lab. Pixel Lab has that feature, so. This, this two, sorry. So let's bring in another one. Let's bring in all the icons. So you we know, we'll continue our design from here. So the location icon. I have the location here. Yeah? Let's use this one. This one is on JPEG. This one is good. on PNG rather. So. Let's place it here. <sighs> Change the color. Let's bring in another one. The last one. Which is the messaging icon. I have done this. It's here now. So when you are designing, you have to calm down. Okay? Calm down. I'm sorry that I'm now looking for all these things here. Because I haven't I had no chance all this way. Should have arranged everything. You already have this one. Sorry. So now, I'm looking for the core icon. You can look for it too on Google. Phone call icon PNG. Telephone icon PNG. So I put all the things. I think it's inside materials. So here. I can use that one. Let's use this one. So we we'll raise the color too. We we'll raise the color. We we'll raise, we we'll raise color. Now, let's hide this, 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 and this. So let's open one. Let's start one after the other. So, first of all. Let's change the color of this shape now. Let's change it to white bag. No. Color of the shape. Uh, 
easy. So we'll continue our design now. We want to bring in a shape. Circle shape. Now I'm gonna change the color to this color. Then I'll bring this one to the front and change it to white. Bring to front. Place it in the center. Make sure your work is placed in the center properly. The video might be a bit fast. Oh, I'm sorry about that. So now I want to change the color of this icon. The color of this icon will change it to white. Okay. Then make sure you place it in the center properly. Okay. Now you copy this one. Copy it and match it to. And you place it here. Okay. Then you bring this one here. Copy it. Let's open another thing here. This phone now. Bring it to the front. Then I'll change the color. Okay, let's see. I'll do it down. Let me bring in another one again. I have more than one self in the phone, so let's see. Design in the spirit. Once the spirit is in your body, make sure all the materials are available. That's another secret. Okay. And you have the time. Great time. Use your preserve lab. Design. Be creative. Practice. Once you are good, you can start creating your own videos online. And start selling and advertising. So that's it. That's it. That's another way of selling your skills. There are a lot of people there that are looking for how to design with their smartphone. I'm going to be showing you how to monetize your, your skills. So by the grace of God, by the end of the class. This time you can hold a live class like on YouTube. I will notify everyone if it's going to be possible. So you gain from it. So bring it, place it up. Okay. Now I want to bring this one here. Remember, if there's still a minimum, we'll still copy it. I need this one here. I'll open another thing again. Location. Bring it to the front. This one is already white. Use your position key. You can use your position key. This one is in the center. In lock. Let's be creative, guys. So this work is an added work that you can use to practice how to design 
a professional business car like this for clients yeah, at least with this video now you'll be able to know how to design a business card that is different from the first one that you did in the practical so let's open this one now can we use this i think we can use let's change the color to this background color please so um No, so this one is like this. I mean. Let's see. Let's change the shape to white too. It's brain or anything that will work. Just calculate. Can you see? It won't work. So we'll look for another messaging. Take this one back to the now. I want to go back to the Sorry about this. So let's use this one this time now. This color. So now just change the color. Better one than this, you can use. So now, you match the two, okay? Then you position it here. Make sure you arrange your work very well. Make it straight. Make it look professional. It might take little time, but you will make it professional. Anyhow, it is. your position to here after I have finished arranging the work it's now time to start inputting the details make sure that all the shape are in the same size that's what I'm trying to do now so use your grid line to align it properly I'll move it to the back Move it to the front if it's anywhere you choose. Feel is too big, you can see you did this. Okay. Because it's just an icon. But make sure it shows when they printed the card. Don't make it too small. Make sure they are in the same shape, they are in the same sizes. So we want to bring in text now. Our call to action. Check your work properly. Pick a font, just a simple font. Change the color to black. Use the size to 30. 
place it there. I'm going to copy it. We we'll use that same font. We we'll use that same font. Axe. Reduce the size of this. Make it 26. Let's reduce this. Go to spacing. Return spacing. Make it 3. Let's leave it like this. I'm going to copy this again too. See if you have a site, you already have a site, you can put it. Then we'll see, copy it again. Okay, let's use another font here now. I want to write number. Chief Palace Avenue Group Lagos. So, can you see? So, just reduce it. So, you go to font. We'll be using this font now. We've already used it before. So you change the color to black. And you increase the size. And you see now. So we have to make everything rhyme. No matter how it is, they will see it. You can leave the phone number like that. Your good line, treating your work properly. So we'll start from the phone number. Let's move it in. Can align left or right. You can also align up and down. So you see. Maybe some back to. Make sure the, the location appears fully. Let's reduce the size. It's now too small, Abby. Make it 18. Let's make it so easy. I have to reduce this one So let's make everything uniform. Make sure everything is on that line, on that line. Make 
since you have arranged your work like this. change the color of the shape black or oh. remove the shape we are going to bring in our picture look at what I'm going to do now look at the picture here from here you make it circle okay and now cut the part here Then you go to stroke, locate stroke, and increase it a bit. Change the color of the stroke to yellow. This dark yellow. Make it one, just leave it like that. Then you bring in the shape. Make it circle. Then send it to the back of the send the shape to the back. The way I sent it, you now change the color of the shape to black. Let's go up. Ship has gone to the back, back, back. Okay, let's send the picture to, to the back. Then we'll bring the ship to the front. Now. Let's see what happens. Show sure now. This ship. This ship is supposed to be under. Are you following? Bring it under, can you see? <laughs> so, want to put, let's hide all this first. So, want that picture of you fit inside of the shape. So, this is just to customize. Okay, make it look different. Okay, you can do something different. You might not use your picture, you can use another thing. And match the two. You got to what you want. Then use your position, just make it very small. Place it there so that when they print it out, that stroke will make it, make it to make sense. Okay? Look at the top, I think the top is not good. Okay? So, when you are designing, check the top of your work very well, okay, and make it look professional. That circle at the top. Let me unmerge it. So you have to unmerge for you be able to. So you have to be checking your work room. Especially before you merge. And you see, then you merge now. Locate it to merge them. Then you can now reduce it. 
and drag it down there. Use your position key. Let's place it in that corner there. Then you open all this one that you hide. And you see, so our front, the front of our card is ready. The front of our card is ready. Now we save this. Let's save it on our phone. And make sure to save it on PZ Lab too. Come here and save our project. New. Yeah. You save it then. You hide. Just hide so many things, okay? Because we'll be using that background now. You don't have to delete anything, just hide, hide, hide. Now, can you see what's remaining? So change the background color fully now to that dark green. Hide that shape too. So we only have the background color here now. You unlock the logo. We'll be using the logo, just place the logo here in the center. With some other graphic work. This one, the smart creator. We we'll unlock it, we we'll bring it here. And you see, are you following, guys? This one can hide it too. So you place it here. Now I want to bring in some shapes just to design the back a bit. So that's graphic work, graphics work, okay? So I want you to do as I do in the video. I want to bring this one, place it here. What color I'm looking for? Okay, copy it. Okay. This one, this. this one that you copy now, you change the color. Following, I now bring it. Place it here. Make sure it's the same size. I touched it. Too. You can see delete this one. You can see copy this. You can see copy it and change the color. Just to get the same size. So don't use your hand now, use your position key. Bring it down. And you can place it there. So you bring this one close. And make this one empty under. You need to be merging everything. You see now that that one is bigger. You have to take your time guys. Now copy this one again and change the color.
Look at the color that I pick now. So this is your position key. Place it here. I'm bringing one more again. Copy this one again. Then change the color. Change the color. Change the color to this. Bring it down. Place it here. Are we following guys? The video is long. So place it very well. And now merge everything. Okay. Make sure to watch the video to the end so that you won't miss anything in this video. Okay, so you send it, use your position to place it in the center. You can see the position key to place it in the center. Place this one to in the center. This is this will be a bit. Place it in the center. Use your position to place this one to in the center. Then move this one up a bit. I need to bring in another shade. Follow the detailed guard, okay? Very easy to design with your smartphone, okay? With good mentorship and practice. Believe me, you become good, be very creative. So now I want to reduce this and place it here. Are we following? This is your position to no, I want to write. Okay? Lock your work, lock your work, guys. I want to write. So, go to size. Make it 22. Then go to bold text. Bolding it. Place it there. This shape, you want to reduce the shape of it. Use your position key to place it in the center. So the design is almost up. Place this one in the center. So. So this is how to design the save. Save new. Can you see? Then you save on your phone too. Ultra PNG. So guys, let's follow the detailed guide. Let's follow the steps, and believe me, you will do more than this. Okay? Thank you. So guys, I'm going to show us how to present our work. Now this is pixel app, so you want to bring in the front and back of the cars that we just designed. Okay, this is the first one, this is the front cover. Leave it like that. Let's see there. You can reduce the size. This is the back cover rather. Um you want to bring the front side now. This is the front. Okay. You see, I'm coming and reduce the size of this. Okay. I'll make the video quick. Okay. Just want it to be of the same sizes. Okay. Now, if you have done that, 
can just going to present your work okay make your work neat you can just send this front side to the back <clears throat> send it to the back then you bring this one down here are we following so you can you can just seize this one okay, you can send this one now to the front send it front side to the front you can just do it like this okay. just see so where you can present your work then you now come down to right like silhouettes graphics okay so pick a font then just make it change the color to be white make it white then go to shadow on the shadow then leave it to be three then go to the size, reduce the size, make it 24, then place it there. Okay, so to change the background color now, I want to be using something like this. Can you see? Let's position your work. So these are to present your work. Okay? Present your work, and now save it like this again leave it on just make it ultra <clears throat> it is how to present your work okay from pcl lab you want to present to a client this is how you do it so thank you